YouTube, and this is Herp to Derp here with a new series I'm going to call uh, Warframe Spy Vaults. We're going to kick things off by describing, by going into what I believe in the next room is what I would call the Grenier Laser Room. The reason is I call You're it the Grenier Laser Room is because it's Trigger the only laser now, room that Grenier is places data. that actually uses lasers. Alright, so the first thing to know about this spy room is that you have to, if you jump in quickly, there is a, a regulator th sensor thingy in the very first room, but when it first spawns, is looking away from the door. So you have to run into the room very rapidly and avoid that thing. Once you've got that done, the rest of the mission is pretty simple. Uh, you actually have two different consoles you have to hack to get rid of those lasers you see there that are uh, blocking off your access to the console. So, and I'm going to go ahead and hack this one here. And because the mission is completely impossible to go through and hack those first. So we're going to go ahead and do that, and then I'm going to keep on working my way up around the outside. If, if I stand on these pipes here, I can stand here for a long time, I don't, and these regulators should not see me while I'm standing all the way up here. We will see. <laughs> we'll see, though. I'll, this is a good room to uh, pop in and out of a site fast, just because, you know? Once in a while, the regulators look somewhat strange, but normally, normally no one looks uh, all up in this room. Everyone is just down on the ground floor, and so as long as you stay away from the ground floor, you're fine. For instance, this passage right here, if, if you jump up and around, it'll throw you out back on, back right next to the door that you used to come in. So I don't like to go that way, because then I have to hope that I'm not coming out at the same time where the, that, that one sensor regulator in the main room can see me. So instead, I just come back up here, this room I was in. And now, if you want, there are a couple different ways to do this. Um, you can hack this little panel right here, and that will open the door to the room, the main vault room. And uh, then you can just hop straight down from here when uh, neither of the regulators is looking. And, oh, uh, uh, go sneeze. Uh, uh, okay. Uh, apparently, it's my sneezy work. Anyway, yeah, so you can just hop down in there and then take out the one guard in the room, and you're ready to go. Or, you can do this the way I like to do it, which is to hop up around like this way. Now keep it, this way I, I'm going works because it's not a, an alert mission, or it's not like a level 30 or above mission. Um, because every so often I notice on level 30 or above missions that this path is blocked, but normally it's not. So you come up this little pipe here, and if you want you can go walk around the edges. But, Either way, there's this little laser protected thing you can just kind of walk through when the laser is down. And now you can just hop straight down into the room without break, break open the door. And I think this is this is one of the good principles of spying. Well, I would say that uh, is uh, whenever you can get into the main hacking room without opening a door to let other people in behind you, that is to your benefit, especially in corpus levels. A lot of times in corpus levels, ooh, this is self tech there. But yeah, a lot of times in corpus levels, you end up where you cannot get away from all the people that are chasing you, and they will Excellent follow you work. into the spy room Clean and make havoc no for alarms. you. If, if, so, if you can, you should leave doors closed instead of hacking them whenever possible. Anyway, right, that's, that's going to be it for uh, the uh, spy vaults number one. Uh, you have to do. P YouTube, peace out. This is uh, YouTube. Did I really say that? No, it's Herp to Derp. Peace out, YouTube. And this was the Grenier Laser Vault.